Hello everybody, I'm Evil Rabbit. Crew Motor Fest video here for you guys today. Oh, I'm getting hit by a, a wagon. Oh, a limo. Oh, get out of the way then. Crew Motor Fest video here for you guys today. It took me a minute to actually get Crew Motor Fest to work. Big thank you to Ubisoft for sending it to me prior to release and the Ultimate Edition. Big thank you to them for partnering up for some videos here. But the reason it took me for so long to get it going, I couldn't get the game to work correctly on the PC. I kept having some lagging issues, I kept having some frame rate issues and things like that, but it resulted with my recording software. But now we're up and running. We are on our Fanatec Club Sport uh, V2.5 because the Moza does not work with the crew right now so we're on the full fanatech setup make sure you guys follow me on all social media all the description box below let's just have a little fun with it so like i said we are here on the crew and we're in the liberty walk 890 just because it was one of the cars that i got and we're just gonna have a little fun with this today not sure what we're gonna really get into, but we're just kind of ripping this this car here on the Fanatec, and it's been a minute since I've been on my Fanatec wheel. But overall impressions, it feels quite nice on the Fanatec. I really hope Moza gives some support for it soon so that I can use all my parameters and stuff like that because it would be real nice to use my handbrake and shifter and everything that's on my rig without having to change my rig over completely. This Liberty Walk car is kind of a killer. I like it. Oh, first kids. I mean, we're there. <laughs> so if you guys are playing crew motor fest, let me know down in the comment section down below. We're having to run this thing in paddle shift. There's no clutch because we don't have the Fanatec stuff on side I didn't fully tear my rig apart because I'm st uh, still using the V the pedals on this rig right now it's actually not bad uh, we do have a static camera at the pool definitely not a bad feel oh. all right problem fixed wheel cams fixed We've, I've just recently been having a lot of uh, some PC issues recently with connectivity with my cameras and wheels and games and support and stuff like that recently that I really need to, I think, completely refresh my PC and uh, go full on reset with all new software and stuff like that. I think I did notice about the finish pedal, it doesn't engage right away until you're like almost all the way on the brakes. That's probably just a setting thing that I need to address. Or it could just be the game. Some sort of uh, dead zone that needs to be adjusted. Like I said, the, the visuals and the sound of this game is so nice. And kind of actually super excited that it's been working now because, like I said, I was having issues before. Or it was not. Yep, that drift thing is going to be crazy. If this car isn't set up for drifting, maybe the cars that are set up for drifting handle differently? If they do, let me know down in the comments. If you guys are on here with this. So we're going to go straight to the Japan and see what we can get into for today's episode. Kind of just dipping our toes into Crew Motor Fest. Once again, a big thank you to the game devs for hooking me up with this. Here we go. Let's go. We made sure you discover almost everything the Japanese drivers have to offer. All right. There's a lot of them. First event available. Six feet unlocked. Buy photos. Okay. Fast travel. Okay. 
Well, we gotta get to the first one, so... Where are we going first? Another activity awaits. We're going. This guy's got the NSX I want, but at least we have this A90. We couldn't take you to Japan, so we brought Japan to you. There's a special gathering tonight at the Japanese temple. The start of a whole new experience. Here's what to expect when getting there. A traditional Japanese summer vibe and lots of Kyusha cars. Meaning, iconic, classic, and made in Japan. On top of this, expect some exciting encounters. Okay. I mean, I'm down. We got a we got a nice Japan car here. Well, kind of. All right, we're gonna do the sprint. I wonder what car it's gonna give us. Oh, it's loading us into the NSX. So the car I wanted, we're gonna get to drive. So that's cool. So make sure you guys follow me on all social media. I'll let you find the description box below. I do appreciate all you guys coming in for another video here on the channel. Got a lot of cool things coming up here in the future with a lot of new games and everything coming out. So I think we're just gonna skip this. And we're just gonna go full send. Oh, we got a factory NSX? That's not what I wanted. But I mean, I guess it'll work. I feel like we would not be doing that in the NSX. Kill. Game on. We're going for some proper Japanese street racing. Let's show them, guys. Gotcha. Got it. Sure, okay. Why not? I didn't, don't think proper Japanese street racing would really involve you crashing. Motorfest asked us to show you how it's done, but we don't do free tours here. You gotta play your part and give us a bit of a challenge. No pressure at all. Yeah, don't scare the kid, brother. I mean... I feel like I should be okay, but we'll see. Are you familiar with the Honda you're driving? The MSX isn't your regular streetcar. It was made back in the 90s to stand neck and neck with the lights. Oh, we have nitrous. Porsche. You sound just like Shingo. Oh, I feel like I'm in Forza. Speaking about Shingo, you know that if a rookie beats us with his NSX, we won't hear the end of it, right? I don't even want to think about giving Shingo the satisfaction. Better focus and win this thing then. I forgot I totally have forgot I had nitrous. I have them on like By one the way, of the hardest you know what NSX stands for? New sports car experimental. I wasn't asking you, Hina. Got you. We're 68% done and we're kind of moving in. Oh, I should have been paying attention. I wasn't paying attention. Oh, well, you can tell it's been a minute since I've done this type of racing. Wow, see that awesome canyon on the left? Eyes on the road, Hina. But it's a nice kind of change of pace. So you guys, if you want to keep seeing Crew Motorfest here on the channel, let me know down in the comment section down below. I'd appreciate it. all the support. mood they said feels just like our own traditional festival back home i mean we're nowhere near first they're gonna they're gonna get us though so i think that's good to be here for this episode here on the crew motor fest we may have to come back and uh try and beat this again so as always i thank you guys for coming back and watching i'm evil rabbit i'll see you guys on the track